Hello guys, um, this is a um, extension on a previous video um, that I did a while back on the ECG holder. Um, in that series, I covered how to use a device, how to use the software, how to use QBIOS, how to use the proprietary software, and a bunch of other things. Uh, one of the things that's um, cropped up um, as an issue with some of my students is I missed a step where I didn't show um, how to um, transfer the data from the ECG holder uh, to this the software uh, file. So I'll just show you that when you do the analyses, um, one of the issues that's come up is sometimes the um, the students, um, when they click on that button there to do the recording, uh, it will say um, preview by there. Now, you have to click it again um, to record because it will say, do you want to um, override any information on the, on the device? So just click on yes by clicking that button again. Now, what you should see is a blank screen at that stage. And this light, this little LED by here should be flashing every about four seconds blue. That lets you know it's recording and you need to record it for five minutes to do your uh, HRV analysis. So that's a couple of uh, little pointers there. Now, once you've done that, um, you stick the uh, data USB, I think it's an A cable in there, and then uh, connect it to your PC um, and then... Um, what you get is um, this um, uh, pop-up box like this here. And this basically has a, uh, a file in there called ECG Wave Bin. Um, and you have to put it into, you can't do the pre-processing here. So if I try and call the file, uh, uh, from the software, um, it will come up as an error, uh, a lack of memory error. So there's an error issue if you try to use the ECG holder file. It's a very easy solution. Just move the file into, in my case, it's this file here, the file where you have the software. So um, it has to be placed in with the proprietary pre-processing software. It's called Flash, and it's like an orange heart. Um, and there's the file there, ECG Wave Bin. Once it's in there, you can now double click the Flash file, uh, click on File, click on New, and now it immediately detects it. So just write in some kind of identifiable um, uh, number or um, something that you will identify. Uh, DE12, I'll do for me. Um, and then you can also fill in age and other things if you want to. Click OK when you're ready. And now it's in the system. Do the analysis again. Fantastic. Uh, let's click on No. The data's, data's there. Uh, and if you click on um, this file here, you'll see uh, DE12. So it's actually recorded it on the it's got access to the file there these ones are other ones in the same file so if you want to do an analysis on it you just double click on it and then do the analysis and then um, follow the steps from the uh, other videos at that stage to get your hrv and plug it into qbios etc so pick it up with the other videos in that uh, previous uh, ecg holder series from that point. Anyway, that's the only point I want to make. Make sure you transfer your file over. Okay, thank you very much.